A mother I know uses a baby monitor when she puts Matthew, her two and a half year old son, to bed. The monitor allows her to see and hear him from another room, and if necessary, to talk to him through the monitor. Now one night, Matthew was restless, bouncing around in his crib. Using the monitor, she said, Matthew, settle down. A little while later, she repeated, Matthew, it's time to go to sleep. After a third reminder, Matthew said, Mommy, no more announcements. I need you. In Sunday's Gospel, we hear that Jesus' presence healed many people of physical maladies. Like Matthew's mother, Jesus gives your presence the power to heal others. But healing others by your presence means being willing to enter into the darkness of others. Now this darkness can span a range, going from the darkness of a child's bedroom to those in darkness by being deeply hurt, in depression or loneliness, or in pain. As baptized Christian, you have this Christ-given power. Now, the big question is, do you have the courage, the necessary action from the heart to use it? Hello, I'm Father Stan Slabe, pastor of Christ the Redeemer Parish in Manville, New Jersey. Hello, I'm Deacon Tom. Please come and worship with us this weekend and learn how our biblical readings apply to your life. In addition, partake in Jesus' great gift for you, the Eucharist. We look forward to seeing you here at Christ the Redeemer Parish. May you and your family have a great week.